Hi everyone, my name's Aldous and I'm 27. I just want to tell you quickly something that happened a little bit when I, uh, a little bit about when I was younger and at about the age of 15. I had some frustrations and experienced some things that uh, at, the, at that age of 15 started coming out and started surfacing for me and I suppose I started tapping into things and, and sort of wanted to experience things and I took up cigarettes I suppose and just hung out with my friends and cousins and that was uh, a bit of a rebellion thing it was that and alcohol and I suppose I used those things and uh, together and and went to parties and just partied on and sort of started to lose the plot a bit and I was listening to heavy music at the time real pretty damaging lyrics and um, I remember sometimes coming home and hearing my mum praying in the early hours of the morning just sort of calling on the name of Jesus that I'd break free from some of these things. Uh, she probably knew that there was other anger and frustrations that I was carrying that may just push me even further down that track. I suppose uh, one particular weekend, uh, yeah, I was pretty drunk and I ended up ended up at a mate's house and we, we sort of just, uh, I was introduced to marijuana and I didn't like it at all. <laughs> I had this bad experience and I vomited about seven times and experienced paranoia and fear and got, got a rude shock, you know, and I suppose uh, that, that sort of was a major turning point in my life to, to find out where I was and I ended up going to church not long after that and uh, one of the elders of the church had a word for someone who was having suicidal thoughts and I began to cry, I was sitting down the back, I sort of started to cry and, and that just turned into like, like weeping, like a lot of just, a lot of pain and hurt just starting to come out and I uh, walked down the front and sort of fell on my hands and knees in the aisle with a real heaviness and my dad was preaching that morning and just made things a little bit funnier. It was all good, but um, yeah, I suppose I just uh, really, from that point on, I, I was able to release a lot of heaviness and Jesus met me sort of on the floor on my hands and knees in a puddle of tears and yeah, he really helped me out, eh? he really came and uh, through the support of that community as well and the people there, they really loved, loved me and uh, I suppose, um, yeah, from that point on, praise to, all praise to God and all glory to Him that He got me out of that and, and uh, set me on the right track. And, um, you know, I've got an anchor now, steadfast and sure, and I'm fastened to the rock of ages, Jesus. And He's my one and all, He's my one and all. And um, a good scripture that I love is, um, I love the depth of it, is the... Um, created me in my inmost being. He knit me together in my mother's womb. He knew me before I was born and and he numbered the hairs on my on my blonde surfy head. So yeah, that's it's on the right track now and praise God he's still keeping me, you know, I'm still clinging to that rock of ages as the it just as the surges of life just keep washing over me and he's there, he's there, he's there. So yeah. Bless you.